A new subvariant of COVID-19 is surging across the country, but some say they've experienced a rebound after taking one kind of medication used to treat it. Welcome back. I'm Carlo Chiquetto. Marcel is off tonight. I'm Jesse Pagan. Today we learned President Biden tested positive for COVID-19. We're told his symptoms are mild and that he's taking the antiviral Paxlovid pill. But some say they're now testing positive for COVID after taking Paxlovid. CBS 8's Amanda Shotsky talked to some experts and has one woman's story. It's called COVID rebound. I spoke to an infectious disease expert about this phenomenon, and I didn't have to look far to find a patient who's going through it right now. Here I am again, positive again. That's my At mom and Oceanside resident Stephanie Shotsky. She's supposed to be on a trip, but instead is sick with COVID for a second time, just five days after testing negative. It happened after taking Paxlovid, a treatment recommended for COVID patients who are at higher health risk, either due to age or underlying conditions. Within a couple of days, I felt like a new person. It was unbelievable. It's the same medication prescribed to President Biden, who tested positive for COVID this week. President Biden is currently experiencing mild symptoms, mostly a runny nose and fatigue. Taken in pill form, Paxlovid has shown to reduce COVID hospitalizations and deaths by 86%. But in some patients, like in my mom's case, it can almost have a boomerang-like effect, causing symptoms and positive test results to return. Never did I think it would come back. Never. It was a shock. The phenomenon known as COVID rebound has prompted the CDC to issue a health advisory. A recent study at UCSD revealed that the patients experiencing rebound were not getting reinfected, but symptoms just seemed to take a pause. The antiviral knocks the virus down, but it doesn't get rid of it completely in these patients. So that when they stop the medication, the same virus that's been hiding just comes back. Chief I, I of Infectious Diseases like Davey Smith says symptoms after a rebound have typically been mild and only last a few days. Paxlovid remains highly recommended for those who are eligible. And the reason to take it is because it works and it does keep people out of the hospital. A worthy cause despite the possible inconvenience. Well, at this point, it didn't come back worse. It just came back enough no. to ruin your plans. Yes, totally ruined my plan. <laughs> if you experience COVID rebound and you have symptoms that were worse than before, you're encouraged to call your physician. I'm Amanda Shotsky, CBS 8.